practices were much more intense when uh, under Mayfield than uh, under our previous coaches. I can remember during two days, I had a particularly good hit, a block, and uh, it bloodied my nose, and which under the previous regime would have meant you were out for the rest of the day. Um, but under Mayfield, he just simply said, <clears throat> "Get that kid a clean jersey and, and let's go back to work." So, uh, uh, just the, the intensity level, uh, a, a focus on getting it right and doing it per, per, you know precisely correct, whether it's a blocking technique, tackling technique, or uh, running a particular play. Uh, he had a real emphasis on uh, uh, doing it correctly. During that spring, we had uh, individual and team competitions within the group and just a, a fanatical uh, emphasis on winning, whether it was on a, a foot race or a, a wrestling match or whatever it might be. We ran a lot of relays where uh, each member of the team was responsible for doing something in particular. I remember we had one relay where you had to do a kip-up, which meant you laid on your back and you had your kick your feet up and out hard enough to jerk your upper body up and to stand up, and then you'd run and do whatever the relay was. <clears throat> if you couldn't do that kip-up, uh, to start the relay or do your portion of your leg of the relay, then your team lost. Uh, immense pressure to uh, to figure out how to get that done. And for uh, for linemen, it was a uh, a bit of a challenge to learn how to do that uh, that particular move to uh, to get it up. But we'd have whether it was bicycle races or uh, wrestling match, whatever it was, you just you had to win, and you just could not lose under any circumstance. And so that was a a real uh, emphasis that that uh, Mayfield brought to the table.